Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to the new lecture on medicinal chemistry. In this video lecture, I am going to discuss with you about the structure activity relationship of barbiturate. Barbiturates. Barbiturate are basically the derivative of barbituric acid. Their hypnotic activity is confirmed by the replacement of hydrogen atom attached to the C5 position by the aryl or alkyl radicals. So basically the barbiturate that are the CNS depression drugs, they are basically derived from the barbituric acid by the substitution reaction in their structure. Because barbiturate acid themselves do, do not have any of hypnotic or CNS depressant activity. Their hypnotic activity can be conferred by the replacement or substitution of the different functional group like aryl derivative or aryl rings, alkyl radicals that uh, can be the saturated or unsaturated side chain at the C5 position. Barbituric acid. Barbituric acid is itself a 2,4,6-trioxohazahydropyrimidine means it is itself a derivative of pyrimidine in which the 2nd, 4th and 6th position are being substituted by the carbonyl oxygen. So barbituric acid itself do not have any of CNS depression or what we say hypnotic or sedative activity. But their sedative or hypnotic antidepressant activity can be enhanced by the substitution at the C5 position. So in this structure they of barbituric acid, this position is the C5 position. Over here you may observe that I have placed R1 and R dash radical. This basically is indicating the substitution site in the barbituric acid. So if this position is being substituted with the any of alkyl side chain, either saturated or unsaturated, allyl or phenyl ring, then it will enhance their uh, antidepressant activity. This one. So beside this, the barbiturate that are derived from this barbituric acid contain the balance of hydrophilic and the lipophilic substituent in their chemical structure because it is required for their proper pharmacokinetic. So, and the hydrophilic region of the barbiturate chemical structure is the 246 pyrimidine trion. So, this ring 246 pyrimidine trion and the lipophilic portion is the 5,5 dimethyl substituent that are being substituted at this side. Clear? Besides this, the sodium salts of barbiturate are prepared to have the water soluble formulation for the barbiturate. SAR of barbiturate. Now let's discuss the different sites in the chemical structure of barbiturate where substitution can be made. So these are, one is the N1 and N3. So this is the N1 and N3 position means position number 1 and 3rd in their chemical structure can be substituted by the small alkyl group that is the methyl. Next substitution we can make is the C2 sulfur. So we can make uh, this is the C2 position over here we can uh, substitute this oxygen with the sulfur atom and it will result in the thiocarbonyl derivative. So next is the C5. At the C5 position, the dye substitution is necessary. So dye substitution can be made, made either with alkyl, allyl or the aromatic rings. And besides this, the other two position that is the C4 and 6 position, these two position must be left unsubstituted. So now let's discuss these substitution site one by one. Like first is the N-alkyl substitution. So N alkyl substitution means the substitution of N site that is either first or third number position in the chemical structure of barbiturate with the smile alkyl radical. So it can be either N1 uh, with the methyl that is the N methyl or N3 would be the N methyl. Clear? So in the once we are going to substitute these N site with the methyl group, it will cause increase in the lipophilicity of the barbiturate and it increases the blood brain barrier or the CNS penetration. So ultimately it will result in the faster onset and decreases the 
ड्यूरेशन ऑफ एक्शन सो ऑल दोज डेरिवेटिव ऑफ बार्बिट्यूरेट दैट हैव द एन मिथाइल सब्सिट्यूएंट दे मे हैव दे विल हैव द लेसर ड्यूरेशन ऑफ एक्शन एंड द फास्टर ऑनसेट ऑफ एक्शन सो दिस इज द सब्सिट्यूशन साइड सो वंस वी आर गोइंग टू सब्सिट्यूट द बार्बिट्यूरेट एट द एन position with the alkyl now the barbiturate will result from 5,5 di substituted to 3,5,5 di substituted derivative because barbiturate or originally are the 5,5 di substituted barbituric acid derivative clear so now we have substituted the third site in their chemical structure that is the n site so now they are become the tri substituted derivative of barbituric acid beside this there is in this n methyl group that is present in the n substituted barbiturate uh, decreases the acidity value of the barbiturate and the attachment of this alkyl that is the methyl group to both n1 and n3 renders a drug non acidic and making them inactive so the important point to learn here is the n methyl substitution must be done only at one side either at n1 position or n3 position it must be done it must not be done at both of these side because if we are going to substitute n1 and n3 both with the methyl group it will makes the drug as non acidic and ultimately the drug will be the inactive means it does not have any of the cns depressant activity the drugs that are the n substituted derivative of barbituric acid or what we say n barbiturate will have the greater metabolism rate and they are being metabolized by the n demethylation and that's why they have the lesser duration the second substitution we can make is the c2 carbonyl group so in the c2 position this is the c2 carbonyl group we can substitute carbonyl oxygen with the sulfur now the derivative of barbiturate will be known as the thio barbiturate so this type of substitution increase the lipophilicity in their barbiturate and it also increases the rapid onset of action and makes the barbiturate action shorter means these type of barbiturate that is the thio pentyl are basically ultra short acting clear so we can only substitute one of the carbonyl oxygen means we have the three carbonyl group in their chemical structure but we can only substitute this one second position carbonyl oxygen why because because if we are going to substitute the 2 4 2 and 4 position carbonyl oxygen will sulfur it will result in the 2 4 diethyl derivative and the, those derivative will do not have any of hypnotic activity clear or uh, and uh, same as in case of 246 triethyl substituted barbituric acid they do not have the antidepressant or what we say hypnotic activity so only one site in their chemical structure must be substituted with the sulfur the next substitution is the c5 substitution c5 is the this type of substitution so barbiturate must be di substituted means over here two sites can be substituted c5 clear so two two functional group must be attached where at this site in order to have the cns depressant or hypnotic activity because if we are doing mono substitution at c5 position then the tautomerism or what we say the type of isomerism will occur in which the keto enol formation will occur because at one of this site there we have the ketone functional group and if we are substituting only one uh, site uh, at the c5 with functional group and then it will result in the keto enol formation and ultimately the resultant intermediate will have will do not have any of the hypnotic activity so if we are going to increase the number of carbon at the c5 site because we have already discussed that we can substitute c5 site with the alkyl radical phenyl or any of the unsaturated chain clear so if we are going to increase the number of carbon at c5 site it will cause the decreases in duration of action means all those uh, barbiturate they which have the 
shorter duration of action must have the lesser carbon chain at the C5 site or overall less carbon atom at the C5 site. The next is the effect of branching chain. So, uh, effect of branching chain at which site? At the C5 position. So, if we are going to compare the barbiturate that have the branched chain at the C5 position in comparison to those they do not have the branch chain so the branched chain derivative will have the greater lipid solubility and ultimately they will have the greater CNS penetration power and that's why they have the greater hypnotic activity but their overall the action will be the shorter duration of action clear so same as in case of if we are going to substitute the branched uh, cyclic or the unsaturated side chain at C5 position then ultimately it will also reduces the duration of action means they also have the shorter duration of action due to increase ease of metabolic conversion to the more polar inactive metabolite because due to the presence of this unsaturation they are being rapidly metabolized and uh, they being converted into the polar metabolites next is the effect of unsaturation at the c5 site if we are going to substitute the barbiturate with the unsaturated or what we say the alkenyl side chain then the resultant derivative will have the greater potency in comparison to those analogs that have the saturated side chain so the example is the aprobarbital aprobarbital is an intermediate acting barbiturate drug that have the allyl or what we say unsaturated side chain at the c5 position over here you may observe clear so double bond uh, at the c5 position clear so those derivatives that have the double bond at d or what we say unsaturated side chain at the c5 position will have the greater chances of the tissue oxidation means they are being rapidly metabolized and that's why they are short acting in the next point is the polar functional group substitution introduction of the polar functional group like hydroxyl functional group amino functional group carboxylic carbonyl or alkyl amine and the so on sulfonic acid functional group into the aromatic ring at the c5 position will decrease the lipophilicity and potency so uh, we have discussed that we can substitute the c5 position also with the, the aromatic ring so in that aromatic ring if we are going to introduce or substitute the new polar substituent like uh, these functional group so the resultant derivative will have the less lipid solubility and ultimately the lesser potency in comparison to those derivatives they do not have this kind of polar substituent Besides this, if we are going to introduce the halogen atom that can be a high chlorine, fluorine or any of the halogen at the C5 substituent, then the resultant derivative of barbiturate will have the greater potency. So this is the summary of structure to the relationship of barbiturate in which we have discussed. We can make substitution at different sites like N1 position and N3 can be substituted with small alkyl that is the methyl functional group. But only one of these sites can be substituted. At the C2 carbonyl oxygen can be substituted with the sulfur that will result in the thiopental derivative that has the ultra short acting property. Yeah, the C5 position dye substitution is necessary. Dye substitution can be either alkyl, allyl that is the unsaturated or the aromatic ring. But if we are going to substitute C5 position with the branched chain, aromatic ring or unsaturation, then those derivative of barbiturate will have the greater potency and ultimately will have the shorter duration of action because of the higher rate of metabolism. Beside this, N1 or N3 alkylation that is a small methyl group that was introduced either at these position that is the methyl group will increase the chances of lipophilicity increases blood brain barrier penetration and that's why they have the faster onset of action and decreases our lesser duration of action shorter duration of action due to high metabolism so this was all about the structure activity relationship of the barbiturate